Hi, good morning. I just spoke to a witness who also happened to be one of the drivers involved in this crash. Now she says a white infinity and the motorcycle involved were speeding down the road. Police say the 25 year old motorcycle rider died as a result of the crash and police are still looking for the driver of that infinity who ran away from the scene. Now this all happening here on Prospect Street in Vernon between Elm and Thompson Streets yesterday around 3 p.m. Now police say three cars were involved in addition to the motorcycle. One of those drivers was Heather Mercer. She says she was parked on Prospect Street waiting for her daughter to get off the school bus. That's when she said the driver of the white infinity looked like it was chasing the motorcycle rider down the road. I heard a motorcycle come like flying it sounds almost loud enough behind me and then all of a sudden I felt a crash into the back of my car and honestly I hope the guy that did it turns himself in and because he needs to pay for what he did. A motorcycle rider was taken to the hospital where he later died. Now Mercer and the other driver stayed on scene, but again, the driver of the white Infinity got out of the car and ran down the road. Police are looking at surveillance video to help identify the driver. Investigators are also taking doorbell camera from nearby houses to help with identifying that driver and to help piece together the exact cause of the crash. Now the victim's name has not been released at this time and no arrests have been made. Anyone with any information is asked to contact Vernon Police. Live in Vernon this morning, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.